dreams. Hey, get up. <sighs> don't put you to work. I'm itchy. Well, you slept in a barn, little lady. <laughs> Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. <gasps> but I bet your daddy scared them all away, huh? I'm, uh, not her dad. Name's Lee. I'm Kenny. Dad, we're in no offense. There's a tractor and everything. <sighs> We better get going, or we won't hear the end of it. That's my boy, Ken Jr. We call him Duck, though. Duck? Yeah, nothing bothers him. Like water off a duck's back, you know? Ah. That's a valuable treat lately. No kidding. But frankly, I think it's because he's dumb as a bag of hammers. <laughs> but he makes up for it with enthusiasm. <laughs> Boy, you're Word stupid is, as a you were on your way to make pile it. of bricks. Our family's from there. Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. Sure, why not? Maybe. We'll see how things shake out with this Herschel guy. <laughs> Good luck with that. He's a hard ass. Honey, Duck, this is Lee. You don't and, say. Uh, what's the girl's name? Clementine. Clementine. That is a very pretty name. Thanks. Well, we should get to work. We've all seen what those things can do out there, so the faster we get this fence up, the better. I want to build a fence. Yeah? Well, I need a good foreman. I want to build a tractor fence. And me whenever I take a water break. On the tractor? Cool! Duck and I will hop to it. <laughs> Poor boy. He doesn't know what's going on. I can keep an eye on your little girl here on the porch. We can visit. Let's go fix the truck. All right. Hey there, girls. So, uh, what do you do when corpses aren't walking around? I'm a veterinarian back in Fort Lauderdale, like Herschel here, except more with dogs and cats and uh, not horses. What is it that you do, Lee? I used to teach up at the University of Georgia. We need to hope that we can go back to our jobs soon, Lee. Back to normal. It can't stay like this. No, I used to. I was let go a little while back. Well, that's too bad. Well... I hear people always clamor back to college after a big disaster. People <laughs> don't want to die ignorant, I guess. How did you handle getting through the city? Kenny just drove. We passed so many people that needed help, and we just passed people over it's some. Looks just like I gotta be just careful, though. Uh, it's okay. Say to these people. You don't have to say Hell, I don't even know his I whole story. To tomorrow. But even then, I can't take away the things we... The things I wonder what happened to his wife. Don't you want to go back to the moment before you knew about all of this? Not really. <laughs> Anybody in their right mind would. Families and barbecues and beers with good friends. Yeah. All of those things. Watch what you say. Those are the things we live for, right? With those gone, what's the point? You two actually look relaxed. I think we're doing just fine. Clementine was just telling me about first grade. Oh, um, uh, how's that? It's easy. Well, yeah. So, you're good? Anyway, it's almost like we didn't see people eating each other for the past three days. <laughs> it's peaceful here, no? Back in a bit. Okay, Lee. Yeah, that's a conversation stopper if I ever heard one. Alright, let's head over here, see what's up with the truck. And see if I maybe can help out old Kenny. Hey there, uh, Kenny. How's your son doing? Good, I think. 
Kachi's got a sister up in Memphis. We were coming back from visiting her. We were in a gas station and some guy grabbed my boy. I thought he was kidnapping him. I was on the fucker in about two seconds and... Christ. Just lucky I was there. We saw a lot of bodies before we stumbled upon Herschel's. But hmm. We're a tough family, Lee. Ain't nothing gonna phase us. So what's your family's plan? Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. Government will start handing out shots and the National Guard will do its thing. On the odd chance things got too bad, we could hop on my boat, I guess. You've got a boat. I'm a commercial fisherman, catching mackerel, dolphin, whatever's biting and paying. Katya wouldn't be wild about it, but the boat's not that bad. It sounds like a pretty good idea. Need any help? Let's no, make a friend. I think I got it. Oh. Do you need any help? What do you mean? I mean in taking care of that little girl. You know what you're doing? You got kids of your own? Nah, nah. No, no kids. Would have liked one then. You know. See you. Hmm. Alrighty then. See what we got going on over here. Okay. Oh, we're gonna go over here by the kid. And uh Sean. Let's talk to the kid. Let's talk to that old duck first. How you doing, Duck? Good. I'm gonna drive the tractor. Ah. I'm the foreman. Lift with your back, Sean. How you doing, Duck? Good. I'm gonna drive the tractor. Okay. I'm the foreman. Lift with your back, Sean. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's talk to Sean next. Sean's still working on that fence. You know how to drive it? Sure don't. I can give you a hell of a critique of the U.S. Farm Bill, though. I'm good. No, oh, okay. You know, Sean's busy. The kid's busy. Let's uh, head back over here. See if there's anything going on at the barn this way before I talk to the ladies again. Okay, so I just did a circle around the house here. Let's talk to the, lady, the ladies and see what's up. You have such pretty hair. It gets lots of tangles. <laughs> hey, back in a bit. Okay, Lee. Huh? Okay. Do 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 Okay. It's not the most reliable pickup in the world, but it gets the job done. Ass face is busy. Okay. Seems like those two are getting along. Can I go in the house? Nope. Guess I have no choice but to help out with the tractor. I don't see anywhere else to go.
Hey, Lee. Need a hand? That'd be great. If you could cut those two bites to length, that'd sure speed things up. You know how to use a saw. There you go. My dad doesn't know how bad it is. No, he doesn't. I saw a guy in Atlanta kill a kid. A boy. Just shot him right in the face. Shit. Damn. Oh shit, damn. He didn't even hesitate. He just turned, put the barrel of the gun right between the kid's eyes, and pulled the trigger. You don't see things like that. It's not like in the movies. They don't fall like you think. Did you have to do it? Do what? Kill. Have you had to off one yet? Oh. Shoot one. I could shoot one, maybe, if it were far away. I'm just glad we're getting this fence built. Dad just wants to keep the family safe and thinks inviting people in is a bigger threat than whatever's out there. How about yours? How's your family? Well, whoever they are, wherever they are, I hope they're okay. Thanks. That's probably all I need cut for now. Thanks. No problem. And Sean, thanks again for the ride. No problem, Lee. Couldn't leave you behind. Anyway, when you see my dad around, he might want some help in the barn. Yeah. Old grumpy ass Herschel. <sighs> Let's talk to the boy one more time. How you doing, Doug? Good. The oh jeez. I'm the foreman. I'm the Look foreman. With your back, Sean. Yeah, 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 yeah. Kid, if you say it one more time, I'm gonna smack you. I'm the foreman. Left with your back, Sean. Okay, let's talk to Grumpy Ass Herschel. See if we can win him over. <laughs> 